Hi, uh, this is me, um, Vault of Horror 6, and I have a DVD update because I got four new DVDs today. And I'm also going to tell you a funny story that happened to me today. So, yeah. But, um, here we go. Okay, first one I have is Botched. This, I watch it, like, for the first time, like, two years ago or something, and I haven't seen it since then, but I really liked it. And I can't really remember what it's about, but I know I liked it. And that's about it. But, um, I'm excited to watch this again, so I can actually remember what it's about. But, um, when was this made? I don't even know. 2008. Or 2006. I don't know. Either 2006 or 2008. Fuck out of here. And, um, but yeah, but if you guys know what this is and tell me what it's about, that'd be cool because I forget. I mean, I'm still gonna watch it anyway, but yeah. Um, then I have Christopher Lee and Peter Cushing in Horror Express. Um, this was made in 1972, and, um, I haven't seen this either. <laughs> Um, but if you guys can tell me what, if it's good or not, then that'd be pretty cool. Um, it looks cool. I mean, Peter Cushing is cool, Christopher Lee, so I'm excited to watch it. Um, the pictures on the back look nice, so I'm excited. Um, then I have, I was so excited, I had... Um, I bought Gacy. Um, I'm excited. I read a lot about Wayne, John Wayne Gacy, and, um, I don't know. I just think he's really interesting. I mean, he's a clown, and I'm scared of clowns, so, whatever. But, um, uh, I'm excited. But, um, I, I haven't seen this, but I'm excited to watch it, though. Um. After I watch all of these, I'm just gonna make, like, a kind of, like, review video. But, uh, I'll do that as soon as I can. Um, yeah. It's made in 2002. Directed by Clyde, Cl whoa, Clyde Saunders. Sanders? I don't know. But, um, yeah. Gacy. And then I have this one. I love this movie. Um, it's Murder Said Pieces. Um, I watched this about a year ago, and I, I just really liked it. I mean, even the cover is so great. I mean, look at that. Look at that. Like, it's awesome. It looks so, like, gritty. But, uh, and Tony Todd's in it, too. Tony Todd's awesome. Gunnar Hansen, that's cool. Um... But, uh, yeah. It was from 2004, and it's, it's like this, like, f photographer, and, like, I don't know. He, he just kind of, like, loses it and shit. But, um, I, I, at least I think. I don't really remember, but, I, I remember most of it, but not all of it. So, I'm excited to watch this again. Um, so that's just my DVD update. I know it's really small, but I never get money, so whatever. <laughs> but, um, I have some news. Um, I am not going to Monster Mania anymore in June. I am planning on going to, instead of that one, to Flashback Weekend in Chicago in August. I think the 12th through the 14th. And the reason for that is because the timing would just be so much better. Because, you know, there's always so much issue of money, so that sucks, but I'm trying to get a job so I can actually go. But this one, Flashback Weekend, I am going. Like, I don't even care. Like, I'm going. Because Malcolm McDowell's gonna be there and I get to meet him again. Like, that's so exciting. I'm so excited for that. And Robert England, um, Scott Taylor Compton, Lance Henriksen, Sid Haig, um, a bunch of other people, but I'm excited though, um, but it, that should be fun. And then today I have a story. 
And it's fine. It doesn't have to deal with horror films or anything, but it's fine. Or, well, I thought it was funny at the time. I went to the mall today, and I met up with my friend Chelsea, Chrissy, and Lloyd. And I never get to see them because they live in Erie, so... Which is, like... Yeah, it's not that close where I live. But, um... So that was cool. I got to see them, but then... We were walking around the mall, and Chelsea turned to me, and she was like, do you want to smoke? And I'm like, yeah, sure. So we went across the street to this movie theater, and behind the movie theater, there's these woods that has, like, a creek inside of it. So we went down there, and we smoked, and Lloyd, like, he is basically the whitest kid you'll ever meet, but he, like, acts so much like a black guy. It's really funny, though. But, um, we were done smoking, so we were on our way back to the mall, through the parking lot, and Lloyd was walking backwards through the parking lot, and I was walking, like, he was facing me, like, walking backwards, so I, he could see me and I could see him, and he was walking backwards really fast, and he was really high, and, I mean, so was I, and so was everyone else, but, um, he got close to this car and I was like dude you're gonna and then as soon as I went to say run into the car he ran in the car like it was so funny I, I like cried it was really funny and then when we got in the mall he wanted food and he couldn't make up his mind of what he wanted he was like oh I want pizza oh my god I want egg rolls oh my god I want a cookie oh my god I want ice cream and I'm like dude I don't know dude and he was like, dude, I'm going to go ask that cop how much a cookie is. And I was like, why? Why Why would you do that? Like, I would not do that. Especially if I was high. I, that's so stupid. And he actually asked the cop, and I was like, dude, you're retarded. <laughs> like, but whatever. He's really funny. I like Lloyd. He's cool. But uh, that was a nice surprise to my day, because I didn't know I was going to smoke, and I didn't know I was going to see Chelsea and Lloyd and Chrissy, which that's always cool, because I like hanging out with them. But, um, yeah. Yeah. So, um, this is just a video, DVD update and some news. I'm probably going to make more videos maybe tomorrow or Monday. Um, yeah. So, I'll see you guys later. Bye.